There's the reservoir, but no sign of Scorpion. Better take a closer look. All units, report the snipers targeting officers. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a Scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! <laughs> Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. <laughs> Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. It must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground, then analyze whatever he injected me with. Okay, should be safe for a minute. We need to analyze the neurotoxin, so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Clipped Alba should be inside the greenhouse. Is that real? Is this real? Is it real? Or in my mind? It can be both. Duck? It's just the hallucinations intensifying. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind. My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility, even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look bleak. I'll miss being with you. I really will. I'm sorry, Doc. I'm so sorry. Yes, yes, you're sorry. And yet, you let it happen. 
Makes one wonder where your priorities lie. I mean, if I was really that important to you, why would you let me destroy myself? I can help you. It's the neural web. It's affecting your mind. You mean the neural web you helped create. The hard truth is, you did this to me. Without your help, I would have never done any of those terrible things. I should have seen more was there, Stiegel Dahl. Time. But I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking the least interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you, it's am I calling you. Maybe I'm just the fevered screams of your dying brain. Real or no, when I cure this voice, I'm coming for you, Mac. <laughs> Big talk from the little bug. Have fun chasing pink elephants. But I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Giant deadly scorpion. Lovely. Thanks, brain. How you feeling, spider? Raw panic crawling up your spine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking the least interesting questions. <laughs> It's not how am I calling you, it's am I calling you. Maybe I'm just the fevered screams of your dying brain. Real or no, when I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac. <laughs> big talk from the little bug. Have fun chasing big illness. Again. You're too late. Just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc. Oh, but it is me. The me polite society found me. The parts of myself I suppress. You help me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. The poison isn't it. You are the poison. Everyone you touch suffers. Stop running from me. Let me try. I want nothing from you! You're a failure at life, love, career. You bring nothing but pain! No, stop! I'm not giving up on you! Please, just talk to me. I can help you! 
so you can treat me like all the rest. Containing me, suffocating me. No, I will let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes, stealing ideas, a rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. There it is, the atropine! Just need to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. You with us? And nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, man. Don't worry. Plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Count on to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. Still with us? And nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your place. Oh, Webs, don't worry. Plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again. Count on it. I need to mix the antidote. Finally, the rib. <laughs> At least he had an imaginary glass jaw. Not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on. Let him get to me. Got it. The world will be better off without you. And you know. Gotta get rid of him and focus on the job. Everyone 
you ever met suffers. Nice. Few more left. If I was your uncle, I would have jumped in front of a bullet too. My inner voice has really developed an attitude. Barely stand up. There's the equipment I need. Finally, I'm running out of time. I can feel it. I did it. Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just. Go ahead and forget that ever happened. Ooh, it's still foggy. Need to work the last of this poison. Before I tackle the other villains. Good time. To go on patrol. Exchange insurance information. You mess with the wrong guy. Mm. Get some <laughs> shot. Yeah. MJ, hey, you mind if I toss a kind of horny ethical question at you? When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh wow, Pete. Thank you, Lotto. That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say, never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew is still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process this stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you.
place since the fire. I think I can afford a quick pit stop at Beast. After me now, too. As if I didn't have enough to worry about. This is Control. Where are we with Union Square? Roger Control, this is ABC Foxtrot. No sign of Spider Man. Contact with Spider Man Control. Weapons free. Clear to engage. He's a mess, but this is not how you reassimilate into society! These guys are like potato chips. You can't beat just one. Parker Luck. We have no obligation to bring you in alive. Hurry up, O'Connell. You're already. So, if you guys stop wanting to kill me yet, hey, the fight men can hope. <clears throat> one rampaging vehicle down, one to go. Crazy Violet Joyride officially stopped. Score. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go! <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. <laughs> <laughs> 